Okay, this video looks at siRNA. I'll run through the diagram first and then we'll go through some of the mark points. First step with siRNA is to get yourself a double strand of RNA. This double strand of RNA is then broken down into smaller units using enzyme action. Each one of these smaller units is called the, an siRNA. You'll notice in the second stage that only one of the strands is used for the siRNA. The other strand is dis discarded. The siRNA is then attached to an enzyme. The enzyme is called a DISA, but that's extra knowledge. This whole complex, the siRNA and the DISA, the enzyme, is known as a RISC. This being RNA-induced silencing complex. Again, that's an extra knowledge of spec that you can use in a unit 5 essay. This risk complex is then, in step 3, delivered to a section of the mRNA in the target cell. Due to the complementary nature of the base pairs in the siRNA and on the mRNA, they join together to form bonds. Once they've joined together, this allows the enzyme to hydrolyze, or digest, or break down this particular section of the mRNA, as you can see here. This is known as cleavage. The uses of this are that if you have a genetic disorder, you can stop that genetic order to being expressed by breaking down this section of the mRNA. This then stops the mRNA, or at least stops this section of the mRNA, being used in translation to produce the amino acids and the proteins which would be expressed in the genetic disorder. So if we look at some of the mark points, we see this double strand of RNA which is cut using enzymes. Each one of these creates a small RNA. It's then important to understand that we only use one strand of that siRNA and it's attached to this enzyme. As I say, a little extra knowledge, it's known as a DISA. The siRNA then guides the enzyme, as I say, it's that, um, that risk complex, to the target strand of mRNA in the cells. Because of the complementary nature of the base, the bases on the siRNA, it attaches to the mRNA, mRNA joins with it, and then that enzyme which it had been attached to hydrolyzes that section of the mRNA, causing cleavage, which means that it can no longer be used in translation.